Ooh, ah. Buffalo, I'll follow you. Deep sea, baby, I'll follow you. Anyway, hi guys. <laughs> I feel like that's how I start off all of my videos. I'm always like, hi guys. <laughs> super excited anyway so this is gonna be interesting this is my first um i don't even know what video this is breathe you guys like my nails i love them anyway hi guys this is <laughs> i'm not saying hi guys anymore well in this video because i actually like how i start off like hi guys <laughs> So this is my first my favorites video and um, since I kind of miss the month of May like usually youtubers upload their my favorites videos on like the first of the next month so like now you probably notice all of your favorite YouTube gurus are uploading May favorites um, for the month of May well I kind of missed that deadline so what I've decided to do for my first my favorites video is summer favorites yay yay these are basically the products that i am in love with for summertime and that they're like my go-to products for the summertime uh there's not many because i don't really like to weigh myself down with products but my staple products have kind of i've gotten some new ones i've you know switched out some old ones and brought in some new ones and i'm um, really super excited to share them with you guys so these are my products for the summertime my favorites stay tuned one of my favorites is my asthma pump no I'm kidding I'm kidding the first favorite is super simple and to be honest you can get it at like any beauty supply store or anything like that any little store little cute store I'm pretty sure Claire's has some too but since it is so hot here and it is summertime for me personally I noticed that I do better if I have some type of air fanning so I got a fan I got it for super cheap like two dollars and it is definitely my favorite that I've ever had so I've had other fans before but so far this is the most durable one and I only paid two dollars for it I carried in my purse without any type of like protection and it's always being thrown around somewhere but I always have it with me so that I can fan myself whenever I get too hot so I will bust out the fan I feel like it's way better than having like a piece of paper or a book or something um and fanning yourself with that fan yourself in style with a fan from the beauty supply store for two dollars so that's my first favorite guys my next favorite is um this what is it my next favorite is this sunscreen here um, I got mine from Walmart and it's the banana boat kids free UVA UVB protection um, sunscreen and I love the sunscreen you guys are probably like that's for kids well I love the sunscreen and I even used it with my friend when she was visiting here we have sensitive skin and if you have sensitive skin and you notice that um, sunscreen makes you break out I definitely recommend that you try a children's sunscreen it's alcohol free tear free sting free fragrance free hyperallergenic and water resistant up to 80 minutes and when I use it I literally there's no breaking out there's no itching it doesn't irritate my skin and it's a spray on which I also love that I don't have to get my hands all icky because I'm rubbing sunscreen all over it can fit right into your purse or your bag so you can reapply whenever needed being here in Arizona like there are no clouds I've realized this living in Arizona where are the clouds where are they like it's beautiful at night but during the day it's so much sun out so sunscreen take it with you so my next go-to product for summertime is sweat block <laughs> I love this product so um, I was looking for something as I said before and I'm pretty sure some of my other videos I am a sweater I'm a face sweater I should say I sweat on my face I sweat on my head and it runs down to my face I sweat on my nose I found this product sweat block on Amazon and I just 
decided to give it a go. After one use, it lasts up to seven days. It's doctor recommended. Helps restore confidence and stop embarrassment. I love how people say, oh, ladies don't sweat, they glisten. No, I sweat. It's really for, uh, I don't remember. It's really for your underarms. I'll tell you here, and they even have warnings like don't use on broken skin, don't use on rash or irritation, and I definitely don't recommend that you use it um, after you've shaved or whatever because you can have some irritation occur if you use it after then. Um, but it's really for your underarms, but I do use it on my face and my head. Basically, um, collarbone up is where I dab it. I don't rub it. They have directions inside here. They have a little cute tab that says don't sweat it. So they have, you know, read me first. So you take out the directions and to control odor, use deodorant daily. So they're basically telling you don't like think this product is going to um, completely take away any body odors that you have but it's really to control your sweat for up to seven days now if you go on Amazon and you look this up you'll see all types of reviews some good some bad as usual I also see a lot of people where they say it burned for me I really didn't have a burning sensation it just tingled a little bit on my forehead and if sweat gets on your face where you've dabbed it so like I went back the second night and I had to dab it on my head because I realized that I wasn't sweating on my my face at all it completely worked but the sweat that it was coming down from my head onto my face it kind of like had this weird tingling I don't want to say burning but intense tingling um, sensation I would really recommend that um, you know if you choose to use it be careful and uh, don't get it in your eyes that's gonna hurt but it does work it does work. I put it on and there was no sweating on my face, no sweating on my head. I love it. This is definitely one of my go-to products um, for the summertime. I do not use this every week. I use it for mainly special occasions. So like my family's coming soon and we're going to have a little vacation. I'll use it for that week. On to the next. Ah. Next favorite is cookies. I love cookies. So, for my next favorite, I have no idea what number I'm on. I have been using this product for probably like four years, four or five years. Yeah, like this is my go-to product for being a woman, for being <laughs> a chubby girl, like just in general. This is a great product. Even men use this product. If you go and look on um, Amazon or eBay, you'll see reviews from men and women that just rave about this product. It is Monastac Complete Care Chafing Relief Powder Gel. It's a skin protective. This product is amazing. I think that on YouTube, girls use it as a face primer. I, I refuse to use it as a face primer. I have a really good face primer that actually is the same consistency as this product. So it's really funny. Basically, long story short, put it wherever skin touches skin and there will be no chafing, no irritation, and it also helps with sweating as well. It doesn't stop the sweating, but it doesn't let the sweat stick to your skin. So it's a very, very good um, product to control body odor as well. I will always use this product. It's great for when you go to concerts, when you're going on somewhere special occasion. Ladies, it's great for that thigh area. It's also great to go along your bra straps. Um, it'll stop the bra from rubbing against your skin. It creates a smooth surface and it goes on clear like it's on my hand right now and you can't even see it so you can literally put it wherever you want I believe that's why so many ladies use it as um, a face primer because it's also mattifying I have gotten so many people to use this product and it'll tell you too for everyone who's probably like ew monistat yeast infections blah it actually has right here on the back this product is not intended to treat yeast infections so do not get it twisted this product is amazing yes I just said that boom on to the next so the next two on the list of my favorite summertime products is you guessed it Mary Kay items so the first is um, the time wise day solution it's sunscreen SPF 25 
and this stuff is amazing it just glides on the skin but I will even wear this day solution by itself because of just what it does for my skin instantly it's not sticky and I love that it has SPF in it it's meant to go on before your moisturizer and after your cleanser a lot of people don't use SPF for their face which they really should they'll put it all over the rest of their body except for their face and this is made especially for the face so love it after that tinted moisturizer by Mary Kay as well I wear the shade bronze 2 in this tinted moisturizer and it's SPF 20 which I love in the summertime I do not wear foundation in the summertime and especially now here in Arizona I wear a tinted moisturizer um, I love this tinted moisturizer because some others that I have tried before they don't have a really good coverage that can be really annoying like you get a tinted moisturizer especially when I compare it to this product this product has great coverage but it's still lightweight there is no creasing because it's a moisturizer so it, it soaks into your skin I love it so much actually that's what I have on now by the way and go ahead and check out my summertime makeup routine because this is basically it also I have on my face I just added some red lipstick I have on two different shades of red lipstick I have on really red by Mary Kay and I have on rouge by Mary Kay <laughs> all right so that was my summertime favorites uh, my staple products for the summertime 2015 I really hope you guys enjoyed my first my favorites video I enjoyed making it anything where I can really talk to the camera I really enjoy so any requests comments uh, statements questions <laughs> Go ahead and ask them down below and I'll do my best to get back to you. I most likely will get back to you because I watch my YouTube comments like crazy. I love when you guys comment. Um, shout out to all of my new subscribers. Thank you guys so much. I really hope you guys enjoy the videos and the content that I'm putting out for now. Um, I'm enjoying this so far. I've uploaded about one or two um, videos every week. So let's see if I can keep this up, yeah? Subscribe, thumbs up, and see you guys later. Bye. Whoa. Oh. <laughs> I'm gonna set a fire. Have you guys ever gotten someone who, like, goes through your entire Instagram and they keep liking picture after picture and you're like, who are you? How did you find me? Follow me on Instagram. Bye, guys.